Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Welcome if you are new. My name is Heather. I'm a homeschooling mom of three kids, elementary to high school. And today is going to be a vlog day. Sorry, my allergies are really acting up so I sound funny, but super excited because we are getting chicks today. Something that we have been thinking about doing actually since we moved into this house right before everything shut down in 2020 was one of the projects that we had hoped to do right off but did not happen. Um, and so now 2022 is here and we are going to get chicks again. This is not the first time we've had laying hens. We had chickens in town when Emma and Jack were younger and it was wonderful. I love having chickens. I think that it's a great homeschooling, homesteading project, especially if you don't have like a ton of property. We have a lot more property now, so I'm hoping that we can get more chickens than we had in town. In town, we were only allowed to have six, and I think we ended up having close to 10. So um, yes, we want to have two chickens for every person, because we do eat a ton of eggs. It's a huge protein source for my family. And yeah, so we are gonna go up to Tractor Supply and see what they have. I did call, they do have chicks. So I'm going to cross my fingers. I think we might get eight today and then go back in a few weeks and get eight more so that not all of the chickens <laughs> are in the house for two months because it's too cold out for them to be outside. They need to be inside and we don't have a barn, so they will be in our entryway for a while. Maybe in the basement, depending on how big they get. Um, but you know, when we had chickens at our old house, they did stay in the entryway for eight weeks, I think was how long we had them. But that is what is going on today. It's Easter weekend. It is supposed to be 65 degrees today, which is wonderful. And part of the reason that we're going today, tomorrow it's supposed to rain, but then we are, we're supposed to have a nice stretch of 50-ish degrees and partly cloudy. <laughs> so it will give Matt some good weather to work on building the chicken coop, which we haven't built. We like to really procrastinate, really, wait until the very last minute, but um, we have two months, so it shouldn't hopefully take two months to build a chicken coop. We shall see, but I'm going to take you with us. Are you filming us? Yeah, what are we doing? Getting, getting chickens. chickens. Yeah, are you excited? Yeah. Okay. Second sunglasses. time. Yeah, you forgot your sunglasses. Second. They are in here right now. You can hear them a little bit. I'm not gonna open it up because we're driving. So we just we just got them home. I'll turn it over, turn it around in just a second. Izzy is very interested in what the heck is going on. What do you think, Izzy? What do you think? He's like, <laughs> like, will you come out and play with me? Oh, I'm not sure. What do you think? Here, like, Excited? Yeah. She wants. She She's wants to get her nose. Oh She's my like, god! Yeah. Yes. Maybe, maybe. Oh my like, god! Should we like? So we have all the little chickens. We got six leghorns, which are the three dark ones, and then three of the yellow ones, and then six amber links. Um, they're all pretty docile and good producers of eggs. Oh, she just got up. <laughs> of course, now that we start recording, she. Yeah. We are at day two with the chicks, and they're doing really, really well. I have one here, too. <laughs> it's so funny how they just fall asleep. So, they are doing really well. Matt stayed up pretty late to make sure that the temperature was okay because we have them in kind of a large uh, container for a brooder. Usually we start with something a lot smaller. Um, I am just lining it with paper towel at the moment, but I am having Matt get some pine shavings 
for probably tonight I will change over their bedding to pine shavings. I usually will keep the paper towels in for like a week, but I think that, I actually think these chicks might have been um, delivered maybe on Monday or Tuesday because they're already starting to show their feathers and they were yesterday when we picked them up. So um, I don't know, it's been, it's been a good many years since we've had chicks. I've actually been going back and reading my old blog posts where I have listed everything that we're doing and like the different stages when we first got chicks, like our first time having chickens. So that's actually quite helpful <laughs> because some of the stuff I've just totally forgotten and I really did not spend much time reading up on stuff before <laughs> we just picked them up yesterday. Um, but yeah, they are doing really well and they seem to be settling in and Izzy is doing really well with them. She sniffed them all. And when they first got here, she was like, just hung her head over the side of the, of the bin right there and just like had her head hanging over it for, I don't know if she wanted to eat them, if she just wanted to smell them more or what, but it's kind of funny. We would pick them up and sort of hold them in front of her face so that she could smell them and know that they were okay to be here. <laughs> but it's been going well. The kids are enjoying having the chicks. Lucy spent the entire day yesterday sitting on a little stool watching the chicks. So it's, it's really fun. I'm excited. I think I'm going to wrap up this vlog here. It'll probably be just a really quick chicken vlog for myself and my family to watch, <laughs> but I wanted to share some of our homestead adventures. I think I did take some, um, I think I did take a little video of my garlic that is growing outside as well, which I will also include. I have to pull the straw back and I haven't even been in my garden since last fall when I planted the garlic because we've had snow up until very recently. Um, but the garlic is already several inches above the straw, so I have to pull the straw back. It's supposed to rain today, so I think I'm going to do it tomorrow. Um, yeah, but thank you guys so much for watching. I will probably have a lot more homestead type content through the spring because it's kind of where we are right now, but yeah. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and I will see you in the next one. Bye guys.